Hi everybody, it's Faith from Fire Sign Tarot. Hope everyone is well. Oh, okay. Since I'm still not making decisions, let's find out who's next in line to receive their September reading. Libra. Alright. Good deal. We're still knocking them out, trying to get them done. Okay. I might not get them done by Friday. Life's happening, but slow but sure we'll get them done by the 1st of September. This reading will be for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Visa. Yeah. Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. If it resonates with you, cool. It's your free will to do whatever you choose to do with the message given to the cards. If you choose to do anything at all, it is your journey, not mine. I just read the cards. If it does not resonate, that's okay too. Check your moon rising or Venus sign readings. You might find something that may resonate a little bit better. Keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid. All things can and maybe vice versa. Might even play out from the perspective of the cross watcher. And cross watches are always welcome here. Libra, sun, moon, rising, Venus, September 2020. Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, September 2020. Alright, what's going on with you? What's going on with them? The obstacle and the possible resolution. Libra, why are you here? Tower reversed. Okay. Possibly in the process of trying to rebuild a tower. Possibly trying to stop one from falling. How do you feel about the person you're dealing with? The chariot. Could be a cancer you're dealing with. Scorpio is also here on the board. Again, we'll throw clarifiers down. But first impression of this card, the first sense I'm getting is maybe you feel like they're becoming more distant from you with this chariot card or they're being pulled in two different directions this way, that way what do you think of them knight of cups reversed hmm Possibly they're not real communicative in the love department at this point. We want from them the Hierophant reversed. Okay. Hmm. Throw some clarifiers down. I don't like that. Hmm. I keep hearing and sensing divorce. Okay. How do they feel about you? The Six of Wands. Victorious. What do they think of you, Libra? Three of Pentacles reversed. Oi, oi, oi. I don't know about this. Lack of a foundation. Lack of a coming together. What do they want from you? Nine of Wands reversed. What's the obstacle here? Eight of Pentacles reversed. Somebody's not putting the work in. Could be both of you. 
Possible resolution, three of cups reversed, okay? Disconnect. There's two threes, so there may be another party involved. There's two reverse threes. Oh, I don't like this at all, Libra. I don't like it at all. Universe, Source, and Spirit, can we get some clarity on the cards in the table for our Libra friends, please? September 2020. Cards on the table for Libra, September 2020. Why is the chariot here? One card for the chariot, please. Why is the chariot here? Three of Cups. Just kind of flew out. Three of Cups. Hmm. I don't like it. They could be coming more distant or being pulled in two different directions by a third party. Mm, 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 mm. Why is the Knight of Cups here? Why is the Knight of Cups reversed here? Seven of Pentacles. Biding their time. Being patient. Biding their time. One more. King of Cups reversed, Eight of Wands reversed, becoming more emotionally distant, not communicating, biding their time. Why is the Hierophant reversed here? Nine of Wands in the upright, Ace of Cups in the upright. I think this hair, if it reversed, is what you don't want. Libra. You want one last push. You want, you want to rebuild the tower. You, you want that. You want them to fill your cup. You want to be able to fill theirs. Okay, why is the Six of Wands here for how the other person feels about Libra? Seven of Swords. Oh. Oh. One more, please. Four of Cups. Mm. 
they may feel like you're the one who's being dishonest and you're the one who's ignoring them and what they're trying to hand you. The Six of Wands can also indicate someone who, who's a little bit on the cocky side. Huh, what? What? Why is the Three of Pentacles reversed here? Why is the Three of Pentacles reversed here for the other person thinks of Libra? Thank you. Four of Swords in the reverse. Unstable foundations, restless energy. One more on that place, the chariot. Again, with the being pulled in two different directions. Again, with the emotional distance. Why is the Nine of Wands reversed here for what the other person wants from Libra? Tower reversed. Six of Wands reversed. Two of Pentacles reversed. There. Oh, wow. Oh, my God, Libra. I'm sorry. They just might want to throw in the towel. Is the emotional juggling that's going on. Why is the tower reversed here? The sun. They may be pulled in two different directions right now. Because part of them wants to rebuild this tower and reestablish this connection. But another part of them is just like, you know, I can't, I can't do this anymore. This is too much. This is too much emotional juggling. There's too much imbalance here. Whoa. Whoa. Why is the Eight of Pentacles reversed here? For the obstacle in this connection. Four of Wands. Work not being put into the connection. One more. Oh, I had a bunch of them hit the floor. We'll take them all. <sighs> Page of Wands in the upright came out so I could see it. Messages of passion. Dare I look?
Seven of Cups reversed, the card of temptation, the Eight of Swords reversed, the card of being locked in one's own cage, cage of their own thoughts, overthinking, the fool, there's lack of trust. I'm taking them all because they all make sense with what's going on here. Doors are opening elsewhere. Offers and messages of passion. Temptation. Confusion. Lack of trust. Why is the Three of Cups reversed here? For the possible resolution. reversed. One more on that, please. wands in the upright, deciding which path you're going to take, disconnecting from the third party stuff, letting go of things and events of the past, disconnecting from other connections, hanging on for dear life. Not accepting that this has to be the fate of the situation. Oh, what has happened here, friends? What has happened here? Now, I want to make this clear. A third-party situation does not necessarily mean someone is cheating. It's not necessarily what it means. It means somebody's nose is where it doesn't belong. So, don't go accusing your partner of messing around. Is that ne is not necessarily what it means? It could be friends or family members nosing in where they don't belong and causing issues. By the looks of things, it's pretty big issues here. Trying to stop a tower from falling. Let's get some advice for our Libra friends. Seven of Pentacles and the Seven of Swords came out. I'm going to pull two more before I read that. Judgment reversed in the fool. Okay. Wait until you know what's going on. Don't jump to any conclusions. And don't kill something that ha doesn't have to die. Okay. You need to have a little bit of trust. Until you know the truth. Don't automatically assume that someone is being sneaky and lying and farting around and things of that nature. The Nine of Swords and the Hierophant. Don't make yourself crazy over this. 
This is a blessed union. Th this is an event. This is supposed to teach you something in your connection. There's a soul lesson here. I don't know what that lesson is. It's not my place to have to learn it. It's yours. I just read the cards, gang. It's just what I'm seeing in the cards. Three of Pentacles and the Knight of Wands. two more before I read that. The five of Wands and Death. I'm afraid to say it. I'm hearing it, but I'm afraid to say it. Don't shake your foundations and cause unnecessary upheaval. But if the time for change has come, the time for change has come. This could be the evolution in your connection. Libra, this has been your reading for September. Let me know how it goes. I'm going to check out. See you in a couple of weeks. Love you to bits.